Mother Teresa received the Ramon Magsaysay Award for Peace and International Understanding, given for work in South or East Asia, in 1962. According to its citation, the Board of Trustees recognizes her merciful cognizance of the abject poor of a foreign land, in whose service she has led a new congregation. By the early 1970s, Mother Teresa was an international celebrity. She had been catapulted to fame via Malcolm Muggeridge's 1969 BBC documentary, Something Beautiful for God, before he released a 1971 book of the same name. Muggeridge was undergoing a spiritual journey of his own at the time. During filming, footage shot in poor lighting, particularly at the home for the dying, was thought unlikely to be usable by the crew. The crew had been using new, untested photographic film. In England, the footage was found to be extremely well lit and Muggeridge called it a miracle of divine light from Teresa. Other crew members said that it was due to a new type of ultra-sensitive Kodak film. Muggeridge later converted to Catholicism. Around this time, the Catholic world began to honor Mother Teresa publicly. Pope Paul VI gave her the inaugural Pope John XXIII Peace Prize in 1971, commending her work with the poor, her display of Christian charity and her efforts for peace. She received the Pesum in Terrace Award in 1976. After her death, Teresa progressed rapidly on the road to sainthood. She was honored by governments and civilian organizations and appointed an honorary companion of the Order of Australia in 1982, for service to the community of Australia and humanity at large. The United Kingdom and the United States bestowed a number of awards, culminating in the Order of Merit in 1983 and Honorary Citizenship of the United States on 16 November 1996. Mother Teresa's Albanian homeland gave her the Golden Honor of the Nation in 1994, but her acceptance of this and the Haitian Legion of Honor was controversial. Mother Teresa was criticized for implicitly supporting the Duvaliers and corrupt businessmen such as Charles Keating and Robert Maxwell. She wrote to the judge of Keating's trial requesting clemency. Universities in India and the West granted her honorary degrees. Other civilian awards included the Balzan Prize for Promoting Humanity, Peace and Brotherhood Among Peoples, 1978, and the Albert Schweitzer International Prize, 1975. In April 1976, Mother Teresa visited the University of Scranton in northeastern Pennsylvania, where she received the Lestorda Medal for Human Service from University President William J. Byron. She challenged an audience of 4,500 to know poor people in your own home and local neighborhood, feeding others or simply spreading joy and love. Mother Teresa continued, The poor will help us grow in sanctity, for they are Christ in the guise of distress. In August 1987, Mother Teresa received an honorary Doctor of Social Science degree from the university in recognition of her service and her ministry to help the destitute and sick. She spoke to over 4,000 students and members of the Diocese of Scranton about her service to the poorest of the poor, telling them to do small things with great love. During her lifetime, Mother Teresa was among the top 10 women in the annual Gallup's Most Admired Man and Woman poll 18 times finishing first several times in the 1980s and 1990s. In 1999, she headed Gallup's list of most widely admired people of the 20th century, outpolling all other volunteered answers by a wide margin. She was first in all major demographic categories except the very young.